The top first on four. It's not even December yet, and the average American spent more than $400 over the Black Friday holiday shopping weekend. Tis the season, right? But what happens when the credit card bill comes in, leaving you with just enough money to eat? Some people are forced to turn outside their homes for help. <laughs> With the holiday shopping season underway, Cameron County Judge Carlos Gascos, also a certified public accountant in Brownsville, says spend wisely. What I advise my clients is, you know, come up with a budget as to what you want to spend this Christmas and stick to it. Uh, if, if you can at all, if, don't charge anything that, that you can't pay off within 30 to 45 days. Gasco says many people go beyond their means for Christmas and make purchases for gifts that will be forgotten in a few months, not to dampen the holiday spirit, but he says being realistic rather than and materialistic is the only way not to break the bank. You know, what people do personally is much like what government does sometimes. They they tend to overspend, they, they spend what they don't have, and they tend to borrow, and uh, they end up uh, uh, financing some of these gifts for years on, on their credit cards. And Those Christmas credit bills combine with the monthly cost of living, and many people are left with pennies for what's most essential, food. In fact, there's been a 40% increase in people valley-wide looking to the food bank RGV for assistance. Maybe a family is uh, pretty good to go with paying the bills and getting food on the table at the beginning of the month. Towards the end of the month, uh, they may have some struggles with that, and that's when the food bank's there to help them out. Omar Rodriguez doesn't attribute the increase in families needing help solely to overspending. A downed economy, underemployment, increase in fuel and food prices are all contributing factors. And if the trend continues, the food bank will be suffering along with them. For how long we can keep up, we don't know, especially if the increase is going to be uh, going up as far as food uh, demand. But we do need a lot more volunteers. So perhaps instead of spending on extravagant gifts this Christmas, make a donation that will go even further. Or just save all together to make sure there is always food on your table. Well, do you think people spend more than they can afford during the holidays? Are you guilty of it? Let me know on Facebook.com slash Action4NewsMarcy.